eat at Nesbitt in Eat No Dark. Okay, I'm Claire and I play Biddy, the housekeeper, Edith's housekeeper. And I'm Phil and I play Glasto, who is a character <laughs> in Edith in the Dark. It's about Edith Nesbitt, uh, but uh, many people know her as being the famous children's author who wrote uh, The Railway Children, The Five Children, It, and uh, The Phoenix in the Carpet. Um, but a lot of people don't know that she also wrote horror stories and they were quite a money spinner for her in her earlier writing career because uh, you could buy them as a penny dreadful um, and uh, they are still, you can, they're still available, they're still in print and in this story, it's set in 1909 on Christmas Eve and this young man has showed up in her, in her Christmas party and has made his way to her study to ask for a reading from her books but she refuses to read her children's stories and she says instead I'm going to read some of my earlier works so she reads out and the actors come together and perform the stories um, spookily. spookily but there's a chilling understory that's going on at the same time chilling. chillingly <laughs> it's exactly so a new. modern play isn't it mm. it's only 2013 it was written yeah. so the tech the, the the interpretation, it's, it's set obviously, you know, as, as Emma said in 1909, and it's got the feel of an old play, hasn't it? It's mm. got a feel, but it's actually, you know, it's got quite a lot of, it's got a lot of wit in it, a lot of um, comedy. It's very funny, yeah. And yeah. all the four stories that we tell, they are all based on Edith Nesbitt's Tales of Terror. Sorry. It's a cracking ghost story, isn't it? Mm. It's a cracking ghost story, suitable for all ages. So just, just come along, because it is, it, it's, it's unusual because it isn't too grotesque, but it, it's suspenseful and it's very descriptive. And I think that you, you conjure these images, you know, when you, when you, obviously when you're reading it and learning it, but it's, it, it's got so much imagery in it. There's, there's virtually no set. We create everything with the story. The story is the key point to it all. So it, it's like you can come along and, you know, if you want to just, you know, sort of close your eyes and imagine at certain points where we are. Don't close your eyes too much because you'll miss <laughs> this fantastic acting, but you'll hear us sort of tell you the story, won't it's, it's been quite a challenge and a really interesting challenge, I think, having playing the different characters and not having lots of costume changes, lots mm. of props to say this is a new story. So thinking about how we deliver the words, how we hold ourselves, the stance, our gait, our posture and um, thinking. And it's, it's just been the most fun, like really brilliant challenge. Yeah, well, it's, it, as we say, it's quite a new play and it's not been performed very often at all. Um, and, and I certainly don't think it's been performed in the, in the East Midlands area before. Uh, we're obviously at the Eldercroft as well, which is a fantastic venue. Um, once you've been to the theatre, you can nip into Tesco's and do your shopping as well. But it's, it's brilliant. No, but it really is good. We're going to have a great night. The atmosphere in the theatre is amazing. We're thinking maybe we'll have some mulled wine, things that we can, you know, we can be quaffing during the interval or whatever. So we'll, you know, we'll warm you up with that and warm you up with the story. I think it's a perfect setting as well because you can constantly hear noises going on and around because we're in the depths of Serpentine. Actually, it lends itself really beautifully to the, to the nature of the play. Um, it's a bit unsettling in rehearsals a few times. <laughs> There's been noises crash and bang and bump and, and you think, who's that? There's only us four here. So, I don't know, maybe, maybe the spirit of Edith is, is with so, us. Uh, Edith in the Dark is on uh, the 6th to the 8th of December. It's at 7.30 each night in the Undercroft Serpentine Green Shopping Centre. Yeah. How much is it? Oh, oh, how much is it? It's £10. It's only £10. And tickets are available from Eastern Angles website, or I think there's a link through from Mask website, which I can give you. It's www.masktheatre.co.uk.